Hello, YouTube people, whoever's watching this, people who are whatever. This is Sniper in the Head, and I'm here to show you how to put music um, pictures on your music thing on your PSP. Um, I'm currently going to activate my remote joy light. There we go. There's my PSP. It's wide enough for you. I can put it on keep aspect ratio so nothing gets distorted. Um, I'm gonna first of all put a music and I'm gonna show you as, as some examples. Um, like disturbed. As you can see, I got my my groupings. They got album artwork. It takes a while for them to load, but that's because it's a bitmap image, and I'm gonna teach you how to make a. It's a bitmap image, and whatever you wanna call it, I call it bitmap. Um, but you want JPEG, JPEGs load like that. I just snapped my fingers there, by the way. <laughs> and what this is going to do, it's going to do that too. You can have each and every single photo like that. Now, I just discovered this today on how to do all this through YouTube. And this is, this video is going to show you how to do it all instead. And so, yeah, there we go. I just did this one today. Um, just to let you know. This is 5.5 gen, so you can't put folders and folders in the, you know, previous versions of the PSP. It's not because this is hacked, it's because it's a higher version of the PSP. But because it's a higher version, I can put folders and folders. And so this entire thing, by the way, to put these pictures on are not hacks. They're just pictures, really. And so, yeah. Um, if you want to do this without doing any work, what you're going to do is that you're going to take your purchased music in your iTunes, like this and you're um you're gonna click and drag them onto your PSP and it'll do it automatically but if you don't like I had to do it with uh the M, &M one shit um relapse as you can see it loads much much quicker because it's JPEG so yeah each and every single song is gonna have a picture and I can teach you. I'm gonna teach you how to do that. Um, I'm gonna put an example as Avenged Sevenfold. I'm gonna do this entire album. As you can see, it takes a while for them to load it. So let, let's go over and change that. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my memory stick, take it out, leave my PSP plugged in, and put my PSP memory stick into the computer, in which it will load through the memory stick. No USB cable connected, because it loads much faster that way instead of spending time going through. USB cable. Anyways, I'm gonna open up my PSP, and there's there's gonna be some things you're gonna need. For one, you're gonna need your PS your your music. I use iTunes. Doesn't matter what you use, Windows Media Player, whatever. Use iTunes. I highly recommend it. It's much better. Everybody has it anyway. So what the hell am I recommending it for? You know where to get iTunes, and I'm pretty sure everybody has it anyways. So yeah. Um, back to the music folders. Eminem. I'm gonna show you how to make that group what you're going to do is that you're just going to take a picture a picture that you want preferably jpeg a jpeg image and name it folder onto your well the folder that you want i want relapse to be have that so there we go i, I use jpeg um event sevenfold image six what the hell oh, i forgot to put this i call it folder Put it in Waking the Fallen. There we go. Anyways, um, sorry about that. First of all, what you're going to do, okay, I'm going to show you how to do that with another one instead. Nickelback, I don't think Nickelback has any. No, that does not. Let's do Nickelback. Search on Nickelback. What you're going to do is that you're, all you're going to do is right click, get info, artwork, right click, copy and open up your folder right click paste and then you gotta name it folder this is for all the right reasons so I'm gonna put it in there and then there we go that folder is gonna have that picture now it's gonna take a while to load so I suggest you do this paint use paint what you're gonna do is file save as 
Still call it folder. It'll still be called that. Just change it to JPEG. Click save. There you go. And now you're going to have two. Delete the Bitman image. It doesn't load as quickly. Plus, you're going to need it for something else that I'm going to about to show you. What you're going to use is that you're going to use a thing called MP3 tag. Um, I don't need this. MP3 tag. I'm going to click it. You're going to see it. MP3 tag. Universal something or other studio. I just did all that. See? It's got it, pictures with it. Delete. Anyways, um, I'm going to show you how to do that. What you're going to do first of all, you're going to go take these pictures. Take all of them that you want. These are from whatever iTunes, but they don't show up. I guess I should have showed you before, but they don't show up. Trust me. They don't. Then you're gonna, what you're going to do is that you're going to go over. As you see, I click it. The picture doesn't show up. picture doesn't show up. You're going to highlight them all. Make sure you highlight them. That's crucial because then you won't be able to save it. Highlight them all or all the ones that you want to have that kind of album. You go back to all the right reasons. Take the folder. Click and drag it over to that disk area. Let go. And there you go. Then you're going to go over to the save. I don't care. Don't click this because then all that's going to go away. Right now it's still highlighted. So go to the save thing right here. Right there. Now I click down. There you go. Then it's just going to write. And I'm going to use some magic powers to skip all this. Now it does take a while for it to load. And yeah. There we go. Save. It's all done. Now I click OK. I minimize it because I don't want it. All these are saved now because I didn't move them. They're all my memory stick. I'm just going to take my PSP out. Or my memory stick out. Plug it back into my PSP. Go to my PSP Remote Joy. Go to Nickelback. It loads right away. No wait, no time for loading or whatever. And then there you go. All the pictures are there. You want to do that to Dark Horse, let's say. Nothing. Nothing. Zip zero. Nothing. Now take the memory stick out. Plug it in. I'm going to go to iTunes. I'm going to right click, get info, artwork, copy, cancel. Go here, PSP, or no, music, go to where your music is, um, Nickelback, Dark Horse, Paste, just going to call it, Folder, Open With, Paint, File, Save As, Still Folder, go to JPEG, Save, Close, Sorry if I'm annoying, but whatever. I don't care. There you go. JPEG. Now that now the album's gonna have that picture. And it's gonna load really quickly. Then you're gonna open up MP3 or MP3 tag. Delete those. Go to these. Click them all. Drag them over to MP3 tag. There we go. Highlight them all. Crucial. Go to Dark Horse. Take the folder. There you go. Save. And now it's done loading after I paused the video. Um, basically, that's how you do it. And just keep doing this to all your songs. Delete. Um, Dark Horse. There you go. They're basically all done. I'm just going to take it out. Show you like I did before. Remote Joy Light. The same memory stick. Plug it in. 616 megs. It might The file size might have gotten bigger. Because the file has to hold that information onto it. Go to Nickelback. Dark Horse loads right away. And all the pictures are right there. That's how you do it, guys. And any questions, comments, um, just comment. Any questions, just comment on them. Please subscribe. And please send me some um, ideas so I can make tutorials for anybody else. Um, you're welcome for making this one. I got asked to do. And so, yeah, thank you. Keep watching. Peace.